Man, you gotta start waking up, man. Man, what you got, sister, man? Sister, Jesus, sister, Jesus, 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 that's all she gonna do is, all you wanna do is just run your mouth, man. Y'all walk up and down here speaking about it. Bring this out. That's the book of 1 Timothy, chapter 2, verse 11. That's the woman learn this son. Read that again. That's the woman learn this son. Read that again. That's the woman learn this son. That's the woman learn this silence. You ain't even supposed to be teaching out here. That's right. That's what the Bible say. That's, That's right. what the New Testament say. That's right. Come down. That's the woman Come down here. What's this? Come, come down here, deal with it. Read it again. Read it again. Read it. Let the woman learn the silence. Read again. Let the woman learn the silence. What does the Bible say? Let the woman learn the silence. Let the woman learn the silence. God like you, how about shit with my One like woman like you, how was shy? We are the battle axes of the most high. And hey, we just out here to wake up the lost sheep of the house of Israel. You so-called blacks, Hispanics, and Native Americans. Right? Y'all are the Hebrew Israelites, all right? Y'all are the people of this Bible. The people in the Holy Bible and the prophets of the Holy Bible were so-called African Americans, man. Hey, I, I want to let y'all know that we're not African, okay? We are Hebrews, okay? All right, let me get Romans. What you got? You got Romans? What you got? Do the right sentence. Do the right sentence. I know. Bring it out. This is the book of Romans, chapter 13, verse 11. Bring it out. And there's no way to tell. Then no. It is high time. It is what? It is high time. It's low time. It is high time. It is high time. It's time for y'all to wake the hell up out here, sisters. All right. What's y'all nationality? Because y'all been out here. Hey. The sis with the, uh, what's y'all what's y'all nationality? What's her name? Kelly Cage. Cage. Huh? Peter and Cash. What y'all been out here this whole time? I'm gonna ask y'all this one question, and if y'all get it right, I'm gonna leave y'all alone. But if y'all don't, I'm gonna go in. All right? All right. What is y'all nationality? Uh, what? Say it again. Teach them all. American, A African American. Yeah, that, that's what they call us, right? I'm gonna ask y'all this. I know. You're yeah, the real word. Oh, with an eye, sis, you been out here all this damn time? No, you an Israelite, sister. That's right. right. You, you're not an African-American. You are a Hebrew. We're not African. We are Hebrews, okay? Hey, okay, and they said they were smart, right? Hey, that because that y'all sitting up here. Hey, that because y'all sitting up there smoking that weed, y'all ain't retaining shit. So like, excuse my language. Y'all sitting up blowing that, blowing that doja, man. You know? Hey, I'm going to ask y'all this. Hey. How did y'all, how did y'all people get to this land, sisters, Cash? How did y'all people get here? By slavery, but out from what mode of transportation? How did, how did they travel here? On boat. Did you know that that's in the Bible? Honestly, did y'all know that that's in the Bible? That we came, that the Israelites would come to slavery on slave ship? Sis, what's your nationality, sister over there? Twisting and twisting and twerking. Nobody want that. Come on, come, come on, sis. Right. Sis tripping, man. Hey, I, hey, 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 Cash. Hey, hey, look, look, basically, look, we, we are out here to teach y'all that y'all are Hebrew Israelites. That is y'all nationality, okay? Hey, y'all stay in the spirit. Stay in the spirit. Hold y'all peace. Right. How you doing, brother? You got questions? Hey, um, Ho Jose, come on. Come on. Jose, come on. Come on. Jose, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, no, nunca no, 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 John the Baptist baptized Christ. Baptized Christ. Baptized the, the John, right? John the Baptist baptized Christ. Juan. 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 Well, what is it? Let me get in English it's John. But yeah. it's Juan. It's porque hay varios este, versiones de la Biblia. Hay uno en inglés, hay uno en 
en español. Sí, en chino, ¿cómo se dice? En chino. Sí. Hermano, ¿por qué quieres saber chino? ¿Hablas chino? Yo trabajo con chino, ¿verdad? Pero, pero, ¿por qué quieres saber cómo dice Juan en chino? No hablas chino, ¿no? That's right. Porque nosotros estamos tratando de enseñar de nuestra nacionalidad de bebera, porque nosotros decimos que somos mexicanos, ¿no? That's right. Bring it on. Pero nosotros no vienen en... Nosotros nada más estamos en México, pero la cosa es, nosotros venimos de otra landia antes de México. That's right. Porque right. nunca... No. Porque no todas las veces que estamos en México, no, mira, México no es de la landia original de nosotros, de las aztecas, las incas, de la maya. That's right. Right. Yeah. La landia original es de Israel. Nosotros ven, venimos de Israel. Dime, ¿quién bautizó a Dios que no a Jesús? Jesús. D A I A E A. Es un nombre que no fue dicho. Oh, oh, yeah. A ver, a ver, a ver, Roma, dígamelo. Y tú puedes decir. Que no voy a burlarse de él, porque si se burla de usted mañana. Yeah. A ver qué fue Job. Platícame la historia de Job. A ver, no más de volada, platícame. Job. Job. This is the book of Sirach, chapter 3, and verse 21. Seek not out the things that are too hard for thee, neither search the things that are above thy strength. Mira, tú estás tratando de entender las cosas que están muy altas para tú. ¿Por qué quieres saber? De, you know, de Juan, eh, ni sabes los leyes de la Biblia. ¿Sabes que Cuando la tierra mira, es... mira, mira, mira. Hoy que es. ¿Qué día es hoy? Hoy es día año 1900. Mira, no, no, no. ¿Qué, qué día es hoy? ¿Sabes? Ah, eso es julio. Es el sábado. Es el día de Dios. Debemos de, este, de tener el día sábado porque es un día bendita, separado. Porque es el día de Dios. No es de domingo. El, do, el domingo no es, no es nada. No, 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 no. Hoy es el día de Dios. Hoy es el día que debemos ir a la iglesia. Sí, no mañana. Quieres ir conmigo en la iglesia y vamos a ver. A ver, let me read this. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 111 and verse 10. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. A good understanding of all they that do his commandments. His praise and do it forever. Este, mira, necesitas tener el frío para Dios. Necesitas este, hacer los mandamientos. No, ahorita no estás bien, estás tomado. Yo creo que estás tomado porque estás hablando medio, medio quebrado. No estás hablando bien. Como estás caminando, no estás caminando bien. Debes de... Mira, hermano. Eh, yo, 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 yo respeto la palabra. Sí, pero respétala. Yo amo, yo amo, yo amo. Pero él es Israel, man. Él es Israel, man. Él es cuando ya estás más vigilante, no cuando estás borracho. Porque ahorita estás borracho, él no puede. Sí, pero... This is the book of 1 Peter, chapter 5, and verse 8. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, is a roaring lion, walking the belt, seeking whom he made the belt. Porque cuando estás tomado, te puede ganar el diablo. Right. Te puede, te, te puedes, cuando no estás viendo que está, que está pasando, no, no estás, no estás alerta. Cuando estás tomado, no estás alerta. Mira, ten espíritu, es like, uh, pero necesitas, necesitas ir a la casa y no tomar, especialmente en la día de Dios. Kind, this is the book of Sirach, chapter 31 and verse 27. Why is it? Why is it as good as life to man 
it could be drunk moderately. What life is then to a to a man that is without wine, for it was made to make men glad. Eso está tomando para ser bien, right? Pero tú estás vinos debería de estar tomado por por nuestra salud, pero tú estás tomando para ser para para ser para quitarte tu dolor, no debe de ser eso. Cuando estás dolorido no debes tomar porque cuando tomes dolorido nada más estás tomando para ser borracho. Hey, um, break this down. Okay. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 61 and verse 1. Bring it the spirit of the Lord God is upon, is upon me because the Lord hath anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. The spirit of the Lord God is upon me because the Lord hath anointed me to preach good tidings unto the meek. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted. See that? Mira, estás quebrado. El Dios mandó nosotros para para demostrar la ley de él, en para señarte, porque ahorita estás quebrado. Que, right. Mira, ¿qué qué tienes, hermano? ¿Estás dolorido ahorita? Porque yeah. yo te veo que estás dolorido. Estás borracho, güey. Has tomado. De, deberías de, Mira, nosotros estamos aquí para señarte. Para yeah. levantarte. Por, this is the book of Sirach, chapter 31, verse 31. Rebuke not thy neighbor at the wine, and despise him not in his mirth. Give him no despiteful words, and press not upon him with urging him to drink. Verse 31 from the top. Verse 30, verse 30. Drunkenness increases the rage of a fool till he offend. It diminishes strength and make it wounds. Man, you say that you're borracho. Nosotros no, no vamos a correctarte porque yo sé que estás dolorido ahorita. Nosotros te queremos, pero tampoco te voy a enseñar. Te voy a enseñar porque yo sé que estás dolorido. Pero la cosa es, debería de estar aquí con nosotros. Debería. He's hurt. Ah, he's hurt. Spiritually. Spiritually. Porque yo sé que usted no está bien en espíritu. Porque estás dolorido. Yo, hasta me duele a mí que estás dolorido. Me duele, me duele mucho. Pero la cosa es, necesitamos levantarte. This is the book of Hebrews chapter 4 and verse 12. When the word of God is quick and powerful, it's sharper than any two-edged sword, piercing even to the dividing asunder of soul and spirit, and of the joints and marrow, and is a discerner of the thoughts and intents of the heart. Porque ahorita, mira, hermanos que hablan español, que está viendo este hermano, este hermano está dolorido porque la palabra de Dios corta. Este es corta. La palabra de Dios también levanta. Corta y levanta. Te va a cortar. Porque es, es, es un sword. Es un arma. La palabra de Dios es un arma que podemos levantar y cortar. The book of Psalms, chapter 107, verse 19. Then they cry unto the Lord in their trouble. He saved them out of their distresses. He sent his word and healed them and delivered them from their destructions. Porque nosotros estamos tratando de levantarte. Estamos tratando de levantar nuestra gente. Porque mira esto, Israel. Nuestra gente está abajo de todas las naciones. Pero estamos tratando para levantar. Porque mira, está quebrado. Su corazón está quebrado. Necesitamos levantar. La nación. Somos el reino del norte. Es el reino del sur. Pero nosotros vamos a poner para atrás la familia. That's right. Put the family back together. That's right. Bring it out. God says, put the family back together. Bring it out. Romans chapter 13 and verse 11. Bring it out. Knowing the time, that now it is high time to awake out of sleep. Man, now it's high time, man. All that is step on the, there is step on us because we need to wake up. Bring it out. The sweaters, man. We gotta wake up, man. It's high time. We gotta wake up from our sleep, man. We gotta start keeping these commandments, man. Every man. Native American, Hispanics, Blacks, man, we gotta yeah, wake up, man. That's right. We can't, man, we can't be transgressing the law no more, man. That's right. We, we get the skin. Then know it is time. Then now it is high time to awake out of sleep. 
but now is our salvation, nearer than when we believe. Man, our salvation is closer than what we think, man. We gotta start waking up and keep these laws, man. What you got? Right, man, the book of Isaiah, chapter 52, verse 1. Awake, awake, put on thy strength, O Zion. Put on thy beautiful garment, O Jerusalem, the holy city. For his part that shall no more come into thee uncircumcised and unclean. Keep the commandments. Keep the commandments. Up and keep the commandments. That's right. That's right. That's what they're going to. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 1, verse 22. How long, ye simple ones, will ye love simplicity? And the scorners delight in their scorning. Man, because our people love simplicity. That's man. right. They don't want to keep no commandments. That's right. Because they're simple minded, man. We got to wake up. That's man. right. Why? We got to stop being simple minded, man. We see the heathens want to be like the heathens, man. We see the Edomites want to be like the Edomites, man. The women see Ru Ruby the Riveter, we want to be like Ruby the Riveter. Man, we see everything else going on in the world, we want to be like them, man. But we don't realize, <laughs> we don't realize and wake up. They want to be like us, That's man. That's right. Hey, they want to be like us. That's right. That's right. They're fools. Hey, no. Man, we hate knowledge, man. We don't want to pick up the book, man. We don't want to turn the page, man. Everything that we need to learn, man, is right here, man. Come on, come on, come on. The book of Ephesians, chapter 5 and verse 15. Bring it out. Like 14. Wherefore he said, Awake thou that sleepest, and arise from the dead. That's right. And Christ shall give thee light. See then, that you walk circumspect, and not as fools. But as wise, redeeming the time, because the days are man, evil. Man, that's right. Man, the days are evil, man. We're living in evil times, man, because we're not on top right now. But that's the thing. We come back to Christ and keep his laws, man. We're going to come back on top. We got to come back on top, man. But the first the first thing how we do that is love. Is love God. Give me first John 5. Bring it up. Man, because how, how do we love God? That's right. Bring it up. The book of 1 John, chapter 5 and verse number 3. For this is the love of God, that we keep his commandments, and his commandments are not grievous. For this is the love of God. For this is the what? For this is the love of God, that we keep his commandments. We keep his what? That we keep his commandments. We keep his what? That we keep his commandments. And his commandments are not grievous. They're hard. Are not grievous. Nah, they're impossible. Are not grievous. Nah, we can't do it. Are not grievous. I'm gonna make excuses. Are not grievous. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. Are not grievous. Man, they're not hard, man. That's right. Easy, man. All we gotta do is listen and read. But we're stiff, man. Man, we gotta wake up, man. This is the book of John, chapter 14, and verse 15. Bring it on. He loves me. Keep my commandments. Man, because if we love them, man, if we truly, truly love them, we will keep his commandments, man. But we keep on turning away from, from our God, man. We got to start keeping the commandments, man. The book of St. John, chapter 14, verse 21. He that have my commandments and keepeth them, he is that that loveth me. And he that loveth me shall be loved of my father. Hey, brother, what's your nationality, man? Man, bro, bro, come on, come on, bro. Man. Come on, bro. Come on, brother. Man, read it. Look at St. John chapter 14, verse 21. Bring it on. He that hath my commandments and keepeth them, he is that that loveth me. And he that loved me shall be loved of my father, and I will love him and manifest myself unto him. That's how we love Christ, man, by giving the commandments, man, and by keeping them, and by showing our people who we are according to the law. To the scriptures, man, that's and teaching them the laws and raising them up when they're hurt. Like that's that brother right. was hurt, man. I can see he was hurt, man. It was hurting right. me, man. If that doesn't hurt you, man, do you really truly love God, man? Because you gotta, you gotta see our people. We're at the bottom of the society, man. We gotta wake up and start teaching them laws. Hey, sister, what's your nationality, man? Sister with the dress. I'm the man. Brother with the do rag. Brother with the army pants. Man, y'all don't wanna hear, man. Y'all love simplicity, man. Get that again, huh? This is the book of Zechariah, chapter 7, verse 11. But they refused to hearken and pulled away the shoulder. Man, our people refuse to hearken. We keep on pulling away. We're like, hey, brother, brother, come listen to the word. Nah, bro, I don't want to listen. Man, bro, you got to come and hearken, man. Because right. it's high time, man. We don't got much time, man. You know what I'm saying? We got time, but we don't, man. We don't know how much time we got, man. So might as well just come listen now. They stuck their ears that they should not hear. Yea, they made their hearts as an adamant stone, lest they should hear the law. And the words which the Lord of hosts has sent in his spirit by the former prophets. 
Man, y'all stop your ears, man. Y'all got the headphones acting like y'all listen to music, man, but they ain't really listen to music, man. Cause I know what them headphones for, man. They used to block things out, man, cause I do the same thing sometimes, man. Right. But y'all know y'all acting like y'all stopping your ears cause y'all y'all can't hear cause you listen to music. But y'all listen to the damn thing, you just don't wanna listen to the word of, of Christ, man. Right. The word of God, man. Come on now. Man, we gotta stop leaning on our own understanding, man. Start trusting the most high God, man. Right. Cause he's the only one that knows what's good for us, man. Right. Not these Edomites, not these so-called white man, not the so-called right. Arab, not right. the Chinese man. Right. It's only the most high God that knows what's right for the blacks, native Americans, and Hispanics, man. Right. Right. In all thy ways acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy paths. Be not wise in thine own eyes. Fear the Lord and depart from evil. Man, we gotta start fearing the Lord, man. This is the book of Jeremiah, chapter 17, and verse 9. The heart is deceitful above all things and desperately wicked. Who can know it? Man, because we're, we're still trying to follow our own thoughts, man, our own hearts, man. But it's deceitful and evil, man, because all it's going to do is take us away from the word, man. Man, I've seen so many people, man. Oh, now nah, I'm not going to go listen. They go the other way, man. Or I'll be waving at them now. They're going to turn the other hand, man. You got that? Yeah, I got it for you. This is the book of Psalms, chapter 111 and verse 10. Oh, yeah. The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. A good understanding have all they that do his commandments. His praise endure forever. Man, that's how we fear the Lord, man. Start doing his commandments, man. We got to start waking up and start doing what's right by the Most High God, and that's keeping his commandments. Because right. if we're not doing that, we're not going to make it, man. We ain't going to make it. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 55 and verse 7. Oh, yeah. Let the wicked forsake his way. And the unrighteous man his thoughts. Let me read that again. Verse 7. Let the wicked forsake his way and the unrighteous man his thoughts. Because he's going to let the wicked go their own way, man. If they don't want to listen, he's not going to make them, man. Because he's going to tell you once. And if you're not going to listen, man, so, amen, so be it, man. And let him return unto the Lord. And he will have mercy upon him. And to our God, for he will abundantly pardon. For my thoughts are not your thoughts, neither are your ways my ways, saith the Lord. Man, because he wants you to turn, man. Man, he wants you to turn back yeah. to him, man. Yeah. 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 Man, you got to start waking up, man. Man, what you got, sister, man? Sister. Jesus, you sister. Sister. What you, what you uh, teach teaching, sister? Hey, hey, let me get Revelation chapter 3, verse 20. Let me get the woman to teach, uh, what's that, Timothy uh, 2? Titus 2. Titus 2. Yeah, let me, let me get the. Hey, sis. What you, what you uh, teach your sister? Sis, you ain't even supposed to be teaching the Bible. Hey, sis. Sis, what you, what you uh, sis, you ain't even supposed to be teaching the Bible. Come down here and defend your doctrine. Right? She can't. That's all she gonna do. All you wanna do is just run your mouth, man. Y'all walk up and down here speaking about it. Bring this out. That's the book of 1 Timothy, chapter 2, verse 11. Yeah, yeah. Let the woman learn this time. Read that again. Let, Let the, the woman, woman learn this time. Read that again. Let, Let the, the woman, woman learn this silence. Let the woman learn this silence. You ain't even supposed to be teaching out here. That's right. That's what the Bible say. That's, That's right. what the New Testament say. That's right. Come down. Let the woman come down learn here. What's this? Come, come down here. Deal with it. Let the woman learn in silence. Read again. Let, Let the, the woman, woman learn in silence. silence. What does the Bible say? Let, Let the woman, woman learn in silence. silence. Let the woman learn in silence. Right? Read. Right. Right. With all subjections. With what? With, With all, all subjections. With all subjections, sis. Right. All right? You have to humble yourself. Read. But I suffer not a woman to teach. Hold on. Read that again. But I suffer not a woman to teach. No, no, a woman's supposed to teach. But I suffer not a woman to teach. No, it's okay for women to teach. But I suffer not a woman to teach. Authority over the men. No, it does say authority over men. Women are supposed to be teaching their children and other women. They ain't not supposed to be out here. Oh, you got that? Bring it up. The book of Revelation, chapter 2, verse 20. Bring it up. Notwithstanding, I have a few things against thee. Hey, you see how those scriptures cut? She down here running her mouth. But now, hey, let God be true and every man alive. That's right. Bible just, hey, this Bible just proved y'all some damn lies. That's right. 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 You, sister, you alive. Jezebel, you damn Jezebel! That's right! 
Keep oh. running down the damn street. Well, Jezebel, read. Okay. Which calleth herself a prophetess. Which calleth herself a prophetess, read. To teach and to seduce my servant. Because all you doing is down here teaching and seducing the Israelites right. to come in and see it in fornication. That's right. right? To commit fornication oh, and mean. to eat things sacrificed unto idols. To eat things sacrificed unto idols. Because I bet that you're teaching Christmas and Easter too. Right. I bet you're teaching that they're in eating pork. Right. Uh, you ain't teaching your people what's clean and what's, what's, clean and what's unclean. Right. Great. And I gave her space to repent. Hey, you Jezebel's down there. The Lord is giving you space to repent right now. Right? Great. Of her fornication. Of your fornication down there being whores. And she repented not. And she what? And, and she, she repented, repented not. But she refused, refused to repent, man. Read. Behold, I will cast her into a bed. Hey, the Lord will cast you into a bed, right? Read. And then they commit adultery uh -huh. with her. Uh -huh. Into great tribulation. Into great tribulation. And tribulation is coming. Read. Except they repent of their deeds. Except you repent of your deeds. Read. And I will kill her children. Read that again. And, and I, will I will kill, kill her, her children. children. The Lord said he's going to kill, kill your children, you damn Jezebel. That's right. right. I know that I am he with such the brains and hearts, and I will give to every one of you according to your work. Hey, and the Lord gonna catch up with you in, in, in these last days. You Jezebel, read up. This is the book of Surah, chapter 25, verse 24. I'm the woman, can't go again it, I'm sick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You damn Jezebel. Hey, you Jezebel with that Chinese hot off. Turn around and listen to the scriptures. Read that again. I'm the woman, can't go again it, I'm sick. Hey, I'm the woman. Of the wicked ass woman came the beginning of sin. Yeah. Because of y'all. Y'all need to humble down and shut the hell up. Right. Read. And through her, we all die. And through y'all, we all die. Thus says the Lord God, man. That's right. Thus uh -huh. says the Lord, man. That's right. Read. Read. That's, it. That's it on that. Read it. Read it. What you got? The book of Numbers, chapter 27, verse 16. Read out. Let the Lord, the God of spirits, of all flesh set a man over the congregation. No, a woman is supposed to be in charge. Set a man over the congregation. The Lord said set a man over the congregation. That's right. I'm out here cutting, cutting y'all up the precepts. All right, hey, let me get uh, uh, Proverbs 28, one real quick. Read up. The book of 1 Corinthians chapter 14, verse 34. Well, God, read them up then, right? Let your woman keep silence in the church. Read that again. Let, Let your, your woman, woman keep silence in the church. Hold on, read that one more time. Let, Let your woman, woman keep silent in the church. Hey, the Lord said in 1 Corinthians, all right? The New Testament, you damn Jezebels. Let a woman keep silent in the church. Y'all ain't teaching lies. Read. Right. For it is not permitted unto them to speak. Read that again. For it is not permitted unto them to speak. It's not permitted for y'all to speak, to be out here trying to teach and prophesy in, in, in front of men. Read. But they are commanded to be under obedience. To be under what? To, to be, be under, under obedience. obedience. No, women's rights. Under <laughs> obedience. Hey, the Lord said you to be under, under obedience, man. You have to be first of all under the obedience of the Most High God, man. That's right. All right. Let me get uh, 1 Corinthians chapter 11 and verse 3. Read it out. Are you, are you there already? It was in the spirit. Read. Read it out. 1 Corinthians chapter 11, verse 3. Read it out. But I would have you know that the head of every man is Christ. Hey, the head of every man is Christ. And the head of the woman is the man. Hold on, the head is not every woman is who? And the, the head, head of, of the woman, woman is the man. man. Hey, the head of every woman is the man. Y'all have to understand these things. Read. And the head of Christ is God. And the head of Christ is Yahweh, our God, right? Read it out. Uh -huh. The book of 1 Thessalonians chapter 4, verse 11. Read it out. And that ye study to be quiet. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Read that from the top, book channel, and, uh, chapter and verse. All y'all women, all y'all women listen, okay? Because this is going to help y'all in the long run. Read the book of 1 Thessalonians, chapter 4, verse 11. Uh -huh. And that ye study to be quiet. That the woman study to be quiet. That's what you need to learn how to do, all right? Y'all study to learn, learn how to run y'all damn mouth. Y'all sit up watching Real Housewives all day and don't know when to shut the hell up. Think he all supposed to talk over your husbands and, 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 and be in me in face. Talk just smack, okay. man. Until y'all get smacked in the face by one of these men. And then you, you know, and then you call them damn cops. Right? Read. And that you study to be quiet. And that you study to be quiet, read. And to do your own business. Uh-huh. And to work with your own hands. That's right, read. As we commanded you. As we commanded you, as the most high commanded you. Right? Read. This is the book of Proverbs, chapter 9, verse 13. Yeah. A foolish woman. A what? A, a foolish, foolish woman. woman. A what? A, a foolish, foolish woman. woman. A foolish woman. Right? Read.
Street? It's clever. It's what? It's, it's clever. clever. Hey, she like to damn run her mouth all the time. She want to be seen. She she can't. She got diarrhea at the damn mouth, man. Right? Right? She ain't simple. She is what? She, she is simple. simple. She dumb, man. It's simple, man. And what? Ain't know it. Nothing. It don't know a damn thing, man. That's right. Right? Hold on, I'm get you first. The book of Sirach, chapter 20, verse 5. Read it out. There is one that keep it silent and is found wise. Hold on. This is for the men and the women. All right? Read that again. There is one that keep it silent and is found wise. There is one that keep it silent and is found wise, man. Read. And another by much babbling. And another by much babbling. Okay? Just talking. Talking and don't know what the hell they talking about. Read. And another by much babbling. Uh -huh. Becoming hateful. Becoming hateful, read. Some man holding his tongue uh -huh. because he had not to answer. Uh -huh. And some keep it silent. Right. Knowing the time. Hey, you have to know the time to speak. Hey, brother with the blue shorts and the cigarette. What's your national? Yeah, you brother. You got on blue shorts. I see you looking at hey, you gotta check that thing, huh? Yeah. What's your oh, so we dealt with you for four? Yeah. So we can deal with you a lot of times? Yeah. So hey, answer this one question. Hey, I'll leave you alone. What's your nationality? It's like, oh, shoot. But I ain't gonna leave you alone, brother. Why you smoking a cigarette? <laughs> brother, brother, you, you know you an Israelite. Yeah, go ahead. How are we gonna go to heaven? How we gonna, let me get uh, Revelations. Let me get Revelations, what's that, 14 and 12? Let me get Revelation 14. Huh? Hold on, say it again. How we know we're gonna go to heaven? How we know that we're gonna, we gonna go to heaven? So, uh, if you if you you have to keep the commandments, okay? Let me get hold on. Yes, we keep the commandments, brother. You keep it, bro? We keep the commandments by wearing our fringes. That don't mean shit. That don't mean shit. Hey, hey, look. hey give me, hey, hey give me, uh, give me Deuteronomy ten to twelve. Yeah, you got that? Yeah, that was Okay, hold on, bring it up. The Book of Revelation. Hey, listen, now, 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 brother, listen, okay? Yeah, okay, listen. Read. This is the Book of Revelation. Chapter 22 and verse 14. Read it out. Blessed are they that do his commandments. Read that again. Blessed are they that do his commandments. Read that they may have right. Hello, brother. You, you ask me a question. Now, 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 yes, we do his commandments. Read. That they may have right to the tree of life. Hey, if you want the tree of life, you have to do the commandments. I'm gonna teach you. Okay? No, don't, don't worry. Trust me. We got you. Read. And may enter in. Through the gates into the city. And that's how you enter in, into the kingdom by keeping the commandments. Read. This is the book of Matthew, chapter 19, verse 16. Yeah. And behold, one came and said unto him, go, Good yeah. master, what good thing should I do that I may have eternal life? Because you basically asking me the same thing. What do I need to do to get eternal life? Watch this, read. And he said unto him, uh -huh. Why colors thou be good? Uh, read. There is none good but what? Read. That is good. Read. But if thou wilt enter, enter into life. But if you want to enter into life to get to heaven, because you asked me how, this is Christ himself. Well, what did he say? Keep, keep the, the commandments. commandments. Do what? Keep, keep the, the commandments. Now you can't do it. Keep, keep the, the commandments. commandments. Christ said, keep the commandments. Right. 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 Amen. You know we can do all things through uh, Christ, man. What's that? Philippians 4, 13. 13. 13. You know what I'm saying? Hey, we, we can do all things through uh, Christ, right? Do, uh, do we even got to pull that? All right, bring it out. The book of Ecclesiastes, chapter 12, verse 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole oh, matter. So, brother, this is the conclusion of the whole matter. You just asked me a question. Okay, read that. Read Fear God and keep his commandments. Okay, so why you out here scoffing? You pointing at me and you saying, hey, you, you can't keep, brother, we keeping the commandments. You ain't right. keeping the commandments. Right. You right. trying to find a way out, brother. Check this out. And they trying to check, what, 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 what you got? I ain't keeping the commandments. I'm keeping the commandments by not smoking cigarettes first. Right, right, you know. So you don't sin? Not will, we don't sin willfully, brother. No, right. we don't willfully say, hey, we strive to keep the commandments. You don't right. strive. We can look at you and tell by your consonants and just how you look that you don't keep no commandment. You ain't, you ain't even trying. Right. You, you ain't, you, and you just admit you ain't trying. Brother, you have to try. So when you see other brothers actually do it, doing it, brother, don't don't go, hey, brother, you, you can't do it. No, we doing that thing, okay? You can do it too. We used to smoke. I started out smoking cigarettes at 11 years old and just quit about three and a half years ago. Right. Straight up, man. I smoked all of their years. When I came to the truth, I eventually weaned myself all the way out of it. And brother, you can do it too. Break them out. You know what I'm saying, brother? You can do it, but you have to try, okay? You have to try, brother. Bring it up. This is the book of Hebrews, chapter 10, verse 26. What we said will after that we have received the knowledge of the truth. Now, you said that you've been out here many times, and the brothers and taught you, so brother, you really already kind of know these things, okay? The Lord said, if you sin will, like, you know that you're not supposed to be smoking cigarettes, right? 
Okay, the Lord said, if you sin with them, after you receive the knowledge, because we give you the true knowledge. Well, we all grew up in church, right? We never, you never heard our pastors read these things out of the Bible, but they've been there whole time. The pastor was supposed to be teaching us to keep the commandments. Read, there were many, no more sacrifice, but sin. Hey, ain't no more sacrifice for sins. You brother, and that's just scary. Right. Okay, because when Christ comes back, he's gonna, he gonna kill you, brother. And not if I'm keeping the commandments. How do I keep the commandments? Give me, uh, give me anything, anything. Give me uh, Numbers 15. All right, so I'm gonna teach you. Hold on, hold on, brother, I'm gonna teach you. This is how you keep the commandments. I'm gonna brother. What, say it again? Okay, well, you asking me questions, so you should know already if you if you know every damn thing. You know everything, you been, you only been in there for six months and there ain't no time. You walking around smoking damn cigarettes, brother. You look drunk and bugged out. Uh, yeah, bro. Hey, brother, keep the commandments. Hold on, right. hold on, you, hold on. But listen, you ask me a question. How you keep the commandments? We we finna teach you some commandments right, to keep. Right. Okay. Well, my brother, why you out here playing games? We we ain't out here playing games. That's right. We ain't spending our Sabbath, our day Sabbath up here, but wake up our people to play games, brother. We we hey, hold on. Listen, we, we, we no. You are you already asked me a question and I ain't answered it yet. Okay. We, hey, we we are. I'm for the for the show you, but we out here to build up our kingdom, brother. We ain't we ain't out here to play games. Right. All right. Bring, bring, so man, give me give me command. The book of Numbers, chapter 15, verse 38. Bring it up. You saying how we keep the commandments? Now this is the commandment. All right. This is the book of Numbers, chapter 15, and verse 38. Okay. Read that. Speak. St slack. The book of Numbers, chapter 15, verse 38. Bring it out. Speak unto the children of Israel and bid them that they make them fringes in the borders of their garments. Now you see us? We have these fringes. All right. We have fringes on the border of our garments, brother. Oh, God, shit. Okay, well, go, well, go get some fringes, brother. Stop, right. make, stop making damn excuses, give man. Stop right. making, brother, we'll give you some fringes. You on your. Brother, if we gave you some fringes now, you probably wouldn't even wear it, brother. Stop playing the damn games. All right. Read. And bid them. Because, make, brother, I'm sorry. Brother, see. if you need some fringes, brother, we'll get you into some fringes. All right, but we ain't out here to play the damn games. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, watch these. Finish that. And bid them that they make them fringes oh, in the borders of the garments. Hey, and the Lord say, me, make fringes on the border of your garments. Throughout the generations. Throughout your generations. That means right now you're supposed to still got fringes, Sam. Fringes on read. And they put upon the fringe of the borders a ribbon of blue. Brother, don't tell me not keeping the commandments because you can see our light shining. We actually doing what the Most High is telling us hey, to do. Hey, read. And it shall be upon you, unto you for a friend, uh -huh. that you may look upon it. Uh -huh. And remember all the commandments of the Lord. See that? So that's the first thing we did. Hey, and even Captain Maccabees will tell you, when he first learned he, he got to wear fringes, he didn't have no fringes. He cut the damn fringes off his curtain and glued them on his well, damn look, shirt. Out. Hold on, hold on, brother, stop. No, no, stop. Hold on, stop. Stop me, no, no, brother. No, you, you asked me to teach you the commandments. No, I'm going to teach you fringes. Hold on. No, you can take some scissors. You can take, hold on, no, brother. No, brother, this is my platform. You can, you can literally take scissors and cut around the edges of your thing and draw a blue line around, brother. Ain't no more excuses, brother. Now it's time for high time for you to wake the hell up and get off your ass, brother. Hey, brother, you don't want, brother, you don't want walking around stinking with your damn pants down to your, to your, uh, uh, your ass. All right? Uh, no, brother, no more damn. Teeth uh, all uh, jacked up, brother. You all uh, downtown looking bugged up. Brother, we can read the spirit on you. Brother, you are in a low estate right now. Brother, where your ride at, man? Where your crib at, man? Right? All right, brother? Hey, keep the commandments, brother. All right? Brother, we just read the commandments. We just read that. This is the book of Surah, chapter 32, verse 17. A simple man. Read that again. A simple man. Hey, what? A simple man. Hey, what? A simple man. A simple man. Y'all brothers chime in, man. Y'all pay attention, soldiers. Read that again. A simple man. Hey, what? A simple man. Simple ass nigga, man. Simple nigga, man. Read. Will not be reproved. You just won't be reproved. You want a simple nigga, man. Right. Hey, hey, and it's sad to see my people like this, man. Read. But fuck it. Hey, and that's why white folks don't have damn no damn them? respect. Them? Brother, I'm helping you by giving you, you these commandments. Read. But fun and excuse. But fun and what? But fun and excuse. All he do is find a damn excuse. Well, you ain't keeping the command with your drunk ass, man. Try us on somewhere. Brother, you're making a fool out of your damn self. Read that from the top. Read, read that from the top.
top, and then, and then I'm gonna let y'all get a ring. This the book of Sabra, chapter 32, verse 17. Bring it out. Hey, simple man. Hey, what? Hey, simple man. Hey, what? Hey, simple man. Hey, simple ass nigga. Hey, simple ass nigga. Reek. A, a simple man Reek. will not be reproved. Just won't be reproved. He just won't take correction. He, he won't because tell brother, we give you commandments. Tell me how brother, we give you commandments and you tell me God that I'm eating. Read, but find it. And that's you. But finding a damn excuse. He always got a reason why. Just like a simple, simple ass nigga, man. Always got an excuse. It's always just like a little punk, man. Read. According to his will. According to what? According to his will. According to his will. Let me get one more. Let me get First Kings, man. Chapter chapter two, man. Let me let me let me get. Cause a lot of y'all people think y'all a man, but y'all really out here. Y'all little punks out here, man. Y'all some little punk ass niggas out here, man. Read this. But then what first? First Kings. Chapter 2, verse 1. Yeah. Now the days of David drew not uh -huh. that he should die. Uh -huh. And he joined Solomon, his son, saying, Hey, man, your forefather, King David, was great man. Man, show kid folk, man. All right? He's going to give you some instructions. Read. I go the way of all the earth. Say, I go the way of all the earth, brother. Read. Be thou strong, therefore. Be thou strong. Be thou strong, therefore. Read. And show thyself a man. And show thyself a what? And, and show, show thyself, thyself a man. man. And show myself a man. And, and show myself a man. man. Show yourself a man. Show yourself a man. How do you show yourself being a real man? Read. To keep the charge of the Lord thy God. Uh -huh. To walk in all his ways. Uh -huh. To keep his statutes uh -huh. and his commandments. Uh -huh. And his what? And, and his, his commandments. And his what? And his commandments. Keep his statutes and his commandments. That's what makes you a man. So I like a little punk out here, man. I always got an excuse like a little broad, man. I ain't trying not to go off on you, brother. But I love you. I gotta go off on you. Read. And his judgment. Uh -huh. And his testimony. Uh -huh. As it is written in the law of Moses. As it is written. I'm reading out of the, out of the law. And you telling me I'm eating it. How dumb is that? Read. Right. That thou mayest prosper in all that thou doest. And whithersoever thou turnest thyself. Hey, everything that you do, you're gonna prosper once you start keeping his commandments. Ask any of these brothers. Okay, I just want you to prosper, brother. And with that, right. I'm gonna get the mic up to hey, Captain hey, Yard. Hey, hey,